hey guys welcome back to the channel it is your girl love i am back with another video for vlogmas slash fragrance i am here with of course another fragrance video if you guys are new to the channel hi my name is love welcome to life with love over here on this channel we are on a fragrance journey we are trying to figure out there we go that's a lot better <laughs> Over here on this channel, we are on a fragrance journey and we discover and discuss all fragrances from the low end all the way to the high end. If that sounds like something you're interested in, please stick around. We also talk about lifestyles such as fashion, food, and luxury over here on this channel. So if that seems like something you're interested in, please stick around again and subscribe to the channel. All right, love, what are we talking about today? Today, we are talking about whether or not the Narciso Rodriguez for her makes us feel fearless, fabulous, and phenomenal. Because of course, you know, that's what I want for you, right? And I want you to look good and smell good while we're doing it. So does this work for us? I will tell you that I've only smelled the red bottle. So this is the first time, this will be a first impressions for me. I've only smelled that one um, in a uh, store. So I don't remember what it smells like. I do remember smelling it earlier in the year and let's see what we likey. Alright, so let's start with the black bottle. I do know that this one came out in 2003 and I know that uh, Francis Kirk Dijon had his hand in it. So these are the Cofrets. So they're 7.5 mils. Generally what I would do is take this and I would put it into a spray bottle that I have from Amazon and um, spray it, but I don't have it with me. So let's see, let me see how I'm gonna do this. Mm. Now I'm smelling this, I can say right now, I'm not gonna dab and put this on me. This is strong. So I can see this being a Kirk Dijon. <laughs> I, I can see it. It is strong. It is almost Armani C strong. And Armani C can be a little strong. Let's see what's in this. Yeah, I'm going to tell you right now, this is this one's not going to be my favorite. I don't know if this is the original one. It probably is since it's the first one in here. It is not going to be my favorite. But let's look at the juice in case you love it. Let's see what's in here. African orange flower is in the top notes. Osmanthus and bergamot. And then the middle notes are musk and amber with the base notes of vetiver vanilla and patchouli this is a very strong patchouli fragrance it won an award for fragrance of the year for 2004 and 2007 damn this is a strong patchouli fragrance yeah this is grandma's church purse and that's who's going to she'll probably get this whole set all right, so that was that. Let's pull out the pink. This is, and is this an Oude Toilette? What the f Let's see. Um, and that is an Oude Toilette. This black one is an Oude Toilette. Baby, if it was a parfum, I don't know what the f This is a Narciso Rodriguez for her, and this one is a Oude Parfum. An Oude Parfum. Let's see. This one... I usually like the pink bottles, but then they can be powdery. So let's see if I'm right. This one was 2006. Of course, um, Kirk Dijon had his hand in it as well. And let's see. Let's see. Because I, I can't. Now, the other one is in my nose, so I can't smell this one. So I'm going to have to put this on. Let's see. I don't have a problem putting it on. So let's see. Again, this is why I transfer these to spray bottles. Oh, oh, let's see. I'm sorry. This is strong as shit. I can see a certain type of, of, of confident, strong, older woman wearing this. This is an older woman's perfume. Woo. Okay. Top, oh, it's rose. It's a rose. It is a rose fragrance, guys. That should tell you everything you need to know. It is a rose. Let me come closer. Let's come closer and get some light. It is a rose fragrance. It is strong. The top notes are rose and peach. The middle notes are musk and amber. And the base notes are patchouli and sandalwood. That patchouli is so strong. 
there's sometimes you love patchouli in a fragrance and there's sometimes you don't if you are a patchouli lover you're gonna love that this is very bohemian and older like okay all right well that's two out of three that we are not in love with the last one is called pure music it's still a narciso rodriguez for her but let's just see about pure music it is oh i'm sorry pure musk i said pure music so pure musk and it is also an eau de parfum it is also an eau de parfum so let's see what these hundred dollar bottles what this smells like this one is the newest baby in the bunch from 2019 i, I can't i can't um i can't smell it my nose I'm nose blind at this point oh then this one's a little bit more interesting this one this one is this one's definitely more interesting um hmm I, I can't you I, I can't put my finger on it and this is that's a long pause isn't it I can't put my finger on it all right 2019 the top note is musk the middle note is flowers and the base note is cashmere. In. I don't know. It's 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 completely different from it's completely different. It's completely different from everything else. It's completely different. I don't know. It it doesn't it doesn't make me want to buy it. It doesn't have anything interesting to it, but I can see that it be it's it's a departure from the line. So if you were to do this, let me maybe give you a better character behind it. If you were to do it, this would be your everyday day scent. I can tell you that right now. This would be your everyday day scent. This could be an evening scent for you, and this is date night. Um or this is date night. So if that makes sense, that's like how this um discovery set would fit into your lives that's the best way i could describe it from one so would i spend a hundred dollars on one individual bottle no but i what i'll say if you love a patchouli fragrance i can see why these are popular but they're too strong it, it, it's too strong this one's every day this is every day all day definitely just nothing like great about it. Okay, I'm not gonna drag this on. That is my take on the Narciso Rodriguez for her discovery kit. And I have given you my opinion and I'm sticking to it. This will definitely be gifted to thing one, which is my grandmother for her. This is definitely going for her. And what I'll probably do is um, give her the bottles, but put the spray, put it in the sprayers, the 10 mil sprayers, so that she has them and can spray them. Otherwise, it's gonna be dumped all over the place. Anyway, that is it for me, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know how you feel about the 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 perfumes. If there's one of yours that are your favorite or something that I missed, just let me know. That is just my take on it. I'm not swaying you one way or the other with the brand. So, anyway, until the next time. I will see you guys in another video. Make sure you subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and please make sure you turn on your notifications. Until next time, guys, ciao.